This is winter. This is winter, folks. The trees are heavily in sleep this time of year. Heavily in sleep. A few nests you can see. Nests. There's one right up there. Zambi. In the bleak midwinter, my birthday. I was born apparently a blue baby on a very cold, snowy day. They had to bathe me in bowls of warm water because they didn't have incubators in them days. They thought it was cold, I think, but it's actually to do with the heart murmur that I had as a child. Oh, look at that, that's a lovely scene, isn't it? So I've never had a chance to talk to me mum as an adult, see? So I can never got to know anything. I only heard everything second hand or little snippets that she talked about when we were quiet together. Little things that I've had to try and remember, of course. Um, I feel really deprived of my mum. I feel deprived of my dad. I shouldn't go on there. We always used to celebrate our birthdays, you see. Um, we always made the effort. I mean, for... well, nice big nest up there. That's got a bird on it as well, is it? Crows, no rooks, no crows, or ravens. So these, some of these reflections are private, and I, I don't know. I don't think I should share them, but I can make them private for a long time, and then suddenly make them public. And I'm not quite sure if people can see them on my tree when I'm still alive. But I have to be careful. Some stuff's too personal, to be quite honest. It wouldn't be right. So. Oh, look at that. Look at that lovely scene. Things, it won't come out that well on the camera. I'm going to turn off a minute. Yeah, okay, you're going all the uh, you're going all the way. All the way down today to the fort. We might not actually go on the fort, but we're going that sort of way.
got to turn off in a minute folks because the battery will go just going up to this fallen tree just in case it doesn't save what I've done so far that can happen Right, over and out. Oh, battery will be going any minute. I'm just doing a little bit. Going up the far end now. <coughs> towards the... Not far from the main fort, which will be up there. I've got a little bit, not lost, I know where I am. But I can't remember seeing the turning with her which I normally take if I'm going to go back up by the water tower. I seem to have, I think I was talking and I missed that bit. So I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't actually looking for it at the time. And I thought to myself, so there's been someone going along parallel up there with the same dog barking the whole time. It could be that they'll come back down here. Um, when you're in it. They might be on a circuit, see? I've heard that same dog barking. <sighs> yeah, I don't do this very often. I do it twice a year, probably once in the winter and perhaps in the summer I'll do it. Or I'm, sometimes what I do is bits of it. Today I've gone. I'm going right round, more or less. Not totally, but a much bigger sweep than I normally do on one of my walks up here. I usually do one end or the other. And then you keep a bit for another time, see? You keep a bit. Oh, look at this. I don't know if I, I don't think I go down there. No, you don't. Somebody's made a den, look. A shelter. Yeah, that's what normally I would have crossed at the top there. Somebody's put in this path. Sometimes the bikers do this sort of thing. They'll have little shelters. Yeah, normally I'd come through here and join back up again. Yeah, you don't come out here, you carry on down, Shell. Do I? Yeah. You did that before, come out early on that path. You go on a bit further, yeah. Yeah, I can't remember, see? Right. Right, small video, it must be lunchtime. This is the last day of um, people supposed to be pruning up here. But they've got the... They put up signs and they put up um, barriers that are stating that um, it smells like cucumber up here they've been sawing, chopping. It must be lunchtime, I think. It must be lunchtime. Oh.
Ja,